Feels like it's been forever since we have filmed for our YouTube channel for fitness, but we've been traveling. Yeah, we've been on the road for two and a half weeks now. Yeah, sorry. So we do apologize for the lack of videos. However, we did get a workout in today. Um, I filmed a arm workout for you guys. I know a lot of people, especially the Arnold, had really good feedback for our 7x7x7 seven by seven by seven shoulder workouts that we post. So I filmed a 7x7x7 seven by seven by seven arm workout today. So definitely enjoy that. Should be a lot of fun, but... Yeah. And guys, don't be afraid to try to make your own workouts. You know, that's... The seven by seven by seven is just a formula, you know, that you can really implement any sort of movement into. So if you want to do a whole body seven by seven, arms, abs, legs, whatever, you guys can just make up your own too. Yep. So don't be afraid to make up your own workouts. Um, but yeah, so it was a good workout today. We have a few more um, stops on our little vacation slash travel tour that we are on right now. But just some updates for you guys. Uh, we are coming to Chicago for the Chicago Fit Expo, May 6th and 7th, which will be awesome. We're having our own booth, Bomar Fitness booth. We will be selling natural science supplements. We'll be selling Bomar Fitness apparel, like cool hoodies and tank tops and shirts and leggings. And we will also have our bands for sale as well there. So if you're in the Chicago area and you want to come out at booth 611, the hours are, I think, 10 to 6 and then 10 to 5, Saturday and Sunday, respectively. So definitely come see us. Really excited. It should be a lot of fun. Yeah, yeah, it'll be a lot of fun. And if you've ever wanted to taste test our pre-workout, you'll be able to do it there. So yeah. that'll be good. So cotton candy, peach mango. I think that's it. So yeah, that's kind of a little life update for you guys. This video probably won't be horribly long, but it is what it is. We're just trying to make sure that you guys, we're not afraid about you, we're just traveling. And um, But we've been active on our vacation. It's not like we've just been sitting around. Like We've been fishing, we've been hiking, we've been snorkeling, we've been going to Disney World, which was a really <laughs> good workout. Um, yeah, that's a good workout. Yeah. Here, <laughs> stuff my face with chicken legs. Turkey legs. Yeah, they were turkey legs. Yeah. Um, but no, we've been having a good time. I haven't forgot about you guys. We just really have only actually lifted twice. And the first time the gym was horribly crowded in Florida, so we didn't film and then we just got to work at it. Here in Nebraska, film that for you guys, like I mentioned. Uh, Josh did kind of like a full body workout thing. So definitely check out his Instagram for the part of the workout that he did. I think that's it. So enjoy the workout. I'm gonna do a voiceover for it because there's no, there wasn't any music in the health center that we were at. All right guys, so like I mentioned in the previous clip, this is a seven by seven by seven arm workout, which means you will do seven exercises, seven reps, and then you will do seven rounds. You will only rest after you finish each round. So you're not resting in between exercises. So the video that you're going to see, this clip is in real time. You'll actually see me do the entire workout. As you can see, I am not going to take any breaks. So the first exercise is dumbbell curls, and you just wanna make sure that you're using a weight that allows you to keep proper form. You don't want to swing the weights around and you'll do seven bicep curls on each arm. Then you will transition directly into behind the back bicep curls. And you want to actually clank the dumbbells behind you each time. This is a really good way to get full extension on your arms. A lot of people have never done this before, so make sure you use an appropriate weight and don't just put any strain on your elbows. Then you will go directly into the next exercise, which is tricep kickbacks. You're going to do these standing at the same time. You can do one-handed tricep kickbacks. Just make sure that you're doing seven on each arm. You could use a bench. You could use a cable machine. You could use a band. You could use dumbbells like I am doing. Whatever you want to do, do that. We'll then transition into the next exercise. And you can see it. Here I am grabbing my camera. And then I'm going to set it down. Wow, content. Then you're going to get on this preacher curl machine. You can do this on a decline bench as well if you want. If you don't have access to a preacher curl machine, totally fine. You could also do dumbbell concentration curls instead where your arm is just dangling. That's totally fine. This is just a different variation of an angled curl, and it really does put all the concentration directly onto your bicep. You also want to make sure that you are getting full extension. Notice how my arm goes all the way down where my arm is completely in line. You don't want to do half reps where you're just stopping halfway down. You just want to make sure that you're getting full extension. As you can see again, switch arms, seven on each arm. No rest in between these exercises, guys. You're going to keep going until you're all the way done with your first round. And then you'll do the, all of this again for seven times total. Get it, Sarah! This is hard. This is a really hard exercise. So 
don't put like beat yourself up if you struggle with this because I struggle with this as you can see next I'm gonna pick something else up where is it I don't know hold on let's wait oh the okay now I found it <laughs> Make sure you have fun with yourself, because why not? So, we are going to sit. There I sit. We're going to do tricep. Nope, we're not. We're going to do bicep plate preacher curls. We're going to do seven of those. Make sure you don't hit yourself in the head, because I've done that before, and it's not fun, and it's really embarrassing. But don't do that, because it hurts. And then your workout sucks, because you're concussed. So don't hit yourself in the head with these. Yay, we're done. Look how excited I am to do this workout. Because it's hard. It's a hard workout. You guys will really enjoy it. It'll kill your arms, I promise you. So now I'm going to move the camera, as you can see. Oh, I've got to adjust it. Dips. Dips are next. I do remember this. Find a bench. Dip it out. We're going to do seven dips. Here I go. This is for your triceps. Super challenging. You can also do it on a bar, if you want. But I'm not that strong. So I did seven, and now I'm going to do my last exercise, which will be band tricep extensions. The gym we were at today did not have a cable machine, so I improvised. I used our Bomar Fitness light band, and I just attached it to the top of the Smith machine that I found, and then did tricep extensions again, seven on each arm, or, well, seven total, because I'm using both arms right there. Duh! So that was one round. Repeat seven times and let me know how you like it.